Welcome everyone. In this video I want to show you how you can turn a modern shirt into a, a detachable shirt collar, which then can be used with detachable shirt collars, like this club collar. Stay tuned. Let's start with the ingredients. You need a shirt, an unstitcher, a very fine pair of scissors, <clears throat> a sewing needle and matching thread. The thimble here is optional. You can replace the needle with the sewing machine, but I don't want to assume that every one of you has a sewing machine, so we will stick to needle and thread. Step 1. Removing the collar by unstitching the one or two seams here on the collar band. This work can be quite annoying and you can see here uh, that you really need the unstitcher or um, the fine pair of scissors because the stitching is quite small and you really don't want to damage the fabric. I'm unstitching the first seam all around and then I will take care of the second seam which is halfway inside the collar. And by the way the small stitches are a sign of a good quality shirt. So the better the shirt, the more annoying the work here at removing this damn color. So this is the color you want to remove, this is the collar band, you can see here there is an upper seam on the outside which you want to remove first and then the color is uh, like reversed stitched so you will need to pull the fabric aside and then you can get to the second seam here and remove it too. And at some point, you will have removed the collar, leaving you with a collarless shirt. So step two will be removing all this fuss around here and sewing the collar band back together.
what you want to do now is close this gap here with a simple back stitch. As you might assume, the step is a lot easier when you're using a sewing machine, but again, I don't want to assume that every one of you has a sewing machine. Step three is removing the front button. And in this case, uh, because it's a button-down shirt, or was a button-down shirt, we have the two small buttons here, which we have to remove too. Step four is um, adding a buttonhole here in front and in the back of the collar band. So you can also use the unstitcher to um, make holes in the shirt um, for the buttonhole. If you have a sewing machine, use the sewing machine for the buttonholes because it's a lot easier and a lot faster. Well, I made two buttonholes by hand, which became uh, well, a bit ugly, but they will do, I guess. Um, if you don't know how to sew a buttonhole or uh, what a backstitch is, I will um, put links in the description uh, with short tutorials on how to backstitch or how to do a buttonhole. Now you have three options for detachable collars. The first one is make one from scratch, like this. I will do another video about um, making detachable collars from scratch. The second option is buying one, like this one. This is actually from Darcy Clothing and this is not an ad. Um, I can really recommend Darcy. They also have uh, actually shirts where you can uh, put on a det detachable collar. And the third option is you buy another shirt, like from a thrift shop or uh, something like this, like um, the shirt was bought from, um, and just detach the collar from the shirt. You can't use this one, apparently, because this collar from the shirt we just um, decomposed, uh, this, this collar is um, missing this collar band here which you need to have to uh, attach it to another shirt so you need another shirt to um, take the collar from and again remove the um, the button usually you have you have the button here like we did on the shirt and add another buttonhole here in the back what you definitely need are these separate shirt buttons a small one and a long one the short one goes in the back because it pokes through two layers of fabric. The long one goes in the front. I'll demonstrate. This is the short one. You put it in here through the buttonhole you just made and then through the buttonhole of the collar. And then you take the long one, first buttonhole, second buttonhole, uh, this one, third buttonhole, and fourth. Nice, isn't it? Et voila, your own detachable collar shirt. You can also buy, of course, a so-called granddad shirt and start from step three because you don't need to remove a collar. And this is how it looks in action.